Boom! What's going on guys? Um, just kind of freestyling this one here. Uh, I don't have uh, much planned except for getting into this right here. Last night I was watching a PokéRev video, uh, the one where he opens up every pack of Pokémon ever. And what I noticed was once he got around the EX era, a lot of the packs he bought were resealed. His video came out about a year ago, and that's right around the time I bought this pack. And I bought this pack off of eBay. At that time, I was buying a lot of packs. Fortunately, I did very well on them, but one of them um, that I did buy was this, and I was always a little suspect on. So in PokeRes video, he does show you the eBay seller, and what I noticed was it's not the same guy. Okay, so we don't have that to worry about. I did win this via auction, and the seller had good feedback, but as soon as I won, uh, I get it, he wanted me to pay immediately, but it was within five seconds of me winning the item, and he was like, pay me, pay me now, you won the item, and yeah, I'm gonna pay you, dude, that's not a problem, but I sell things on eBay too, I, I sell things in other places, and certain things people win, and they take a little bit to pay. You know, um, I usually like to pay everyone immediately as soon as I win it, uh, but I don't really need a comment letting me know, and that kind of threw me off as to why he would need me to pay immediately. And then when I got the pack, I, I don't know, it just, it feels thinner than what I'm used to in Pokemon packs. Now I haven't opened up much EX era, but even the cards feel like, like a little off in it. Um, before we get into opening this though, we're going to open up one of these boxes here, the Verizian box. And uh, we'll open up some packs and then we'll open up the uh, Crystal Guardians, uh, build the suspense a little bit and see, was I scammed? Uh, I'm not 100% sure if I was or not, but we shall see. Okay guys, let's crack this open. The big boy card. Couple Lost Origin. Oh, we got Astral Radiance Lost Origin. Another Lost Origin, and we got Fusion Strike. So we're just gonna build a little suspense here. Uh, we'll do it in this order, actually, just like so. Since Fusion Strike's got so much hype around it at the moment, uh, we'll save that one for last. But you know what? We're really saving for last, and that's our Crystal Guardians. I wore my Charizard hoodie for the occasion. So uh, hopefully we can pull the Charizard. It's gonna be my first go ever opening up uh, Crystal Guardians. Um, so you guys are gonna have to help me out a little bit. Let me know in the comment section. Am I even pulling the right cards from, uh, from that set, you know? Uh, a lot of it I'm gonna have to go back and look at footage, but if you guys could help me out there, uh, and let me know. Let me know um, what I'm pulling out of there, if it's legit. Uh, obviously, I'll know some of it if it's not legit, but... Let's see what we got here, guys. And nothing. Nice sleeping card, but, you know. Uh, it'd be dope if we could pull something out of here. And then if we do wind up getting... Uh, scammed or burned on that crystal guardians at least uh you know made up for it you know we're just uh one garatina away my bad guys have you guys opened up packs before and been scammed before um i know i've asked this in the past and you guys let me know but uh we are building here the last time i probably asked that question i probably only had a couple hundred subs and now we are just a little bit away from 500. Um, so, you know, there's more folks here than usual. Um, that was a cool Pikachu card. That's the only reason why I shouted, shouted it out like that. Um, but yeah, let me know if you've been scammed before. Um, and let me know if you've even been scammed in Pokemon or another TCG or what it was. Was it sneakers? Um, I remember buying the Dinosaur Juniors. If you guys, I, I don't know if you know those sneakers or not, but I once bought a pair of those when I got into sneakers back in the day. And um, and I apparently bought some fakes online. And my buddy just straight up was like, yeah, dude, that website you bought them from is 
fake. Like, you shouldn't have done that. Like, okay, thanks. Um, but I did get my money back. Um, I, I canceled it immediately and got my money back. I didn't really even have to fight too hard for it or anything. Um, and have you guys come across that issue where, you know, you did get scammed and whoever it was fought you to get your money back. The gentleman who I bought it from, I'm just assuming it was a gentleman, sorry. Um, but the gentleman, you know, was he a gentleman, the gentleman like he is, uh, person I bought it from, as soon as I bought it, he was like, pay immediately, pay right now. And like, cool, dude, the paying's not a problem. I'm going to pay you. I, I sell things on eBay. I sell things wherever. And yeah, dude, some people take a little bit to pay, but I'm going to pay you immediately. I just don't mean to have someone firing off shots that I have to pay them immediately. Um, yeah, it, it's just not cool. Uh, and it, it sent up a little bit of a red flag to me. Then the pack came and the pack just feels a little thin. It feels a little sketch. Um, I bought it to actually sell myself, you know, to flip, make a couple bucks on it. And when I got it, I was just like, nah, I, I can't sell this to somebody. Um, wow, we really didn't get anything out of that box. Why does it feel, this card feels thicker than usual. Uh, yeah, it really does. So look thicker than usual too. Like, it just feels thick uh, for some weird reason. But anywho, we got nothing out of that. Let's get into the Crystal Guardians. If you guys notice different cards from different eras in here, let me know. And let's see if we got anything out of this. Okay, so real quick, let's just take a little inspection here. You guys notice anything fishy at all? Uh, I don't really right now, just because, eh, well. Uh, but yeah, a lot of packs sometimes are just stuck like that. Um, that's how they come. But can you guys see, do they look? Sometimes they use like a little iron thing or whatever to press them down gloom and then press them down. It feels rigid still. But uh yeah let's see. Let's see how this is gonna open here. It doesn't feel like it's open in the same way but it is old. Tough to tell. Just seeing, trying to see if it feels sticky or anything like that. Just gonna put the cards down real quick. We can inspect this together. It's kind of tough to tell. Um, not a hundred percent sure. I guess never opening uh, this era before it makes it tough, but it doesn't look all that bad. But you guys let me know. Do you guys think it looks bad? And if you do think it looks bad, where, where would you say it looks? I mean, the part I'm a little sus on is maybe like up here. But yeah, let's uh, let's just see. We're just gonna get right into it. Not a hundred percent sure of pack tricks or anything like that with uh, Crystal Guardians. So we'll see if we could get a hit out of here be great okay nice stamp crystal guardians card and nothing out of it but who really knows now in pokey revs video he noticed that a lot of the cards were scratched and the condition just didn't seem right uh, for being pack fresh cards, they look like they were out of the packs before. These ones don't look bad. Um, let's get back to that card here. Here we are, the Shuppet. I mean, it doesn't look terrible. It doesn't look like it's been out of a pack before. It's not noticeable scratches or anything, just the normal things that could happen. Actually, it looks pretty clean. Maybe a little something up there. Up there. Can you see right there? But that's not even all that bad. That's a, that's not from it being like out of a pack before or anything. I mean, it looks fairly clean. Probably worth grading even. Um, I'm not sure the value of what a Shuppet uh, goes for, but yeah, guys, let me know uh, in the comment section 
what you think. Is this a resealed pack or not? My guess, my guess would be if it was, they definitely put that card in there just to make you feel like you got something, obviously, but my, my guess is it, it wasn't. Um, but for the folks out there that did open a lot more Crystal Guardians than I ever have, being that this is my first one I've ever opened, let me know. Let me know in the comment section. Please like, please subscribe. We're on the road to 500, doing a massive giveaway at 500 subs. So please like, please comment, please subscribe. Uh, every little bit helps trying to build a little community. Uh, I want to grow and I want you guys to grow with me. Awesome, guys. Thank you. Have a good night.